Assalamualaikum students. In the last lecture, we have done exercise 12b, question 3. Today, we will do exercise 12b, question 2, resource book new in mathematics, 7th edition. In the question 2, construct a rectangle of size 96 mm and 84 mm. Measure and write down the length of each of the two diagonals. Here in the question, the lengths are given in millimeter. First of all, we will convert. First of all, we will convert millimeter into centimeter. To convert this length of millimeter into centimeter, we will divide by ten. In the centimeter, eight point four is the value. Same is that 96 millimeter divided by 10 is equal to 9.6 centimeter because to convert every millimeter to centimeter we will divide with 10. Now it is a property of rectangle that the opposite sides opposite parallel sides are of same length. These are two opposite parallel sides if this is 2 centimeter then the other side will be also of 2 centimeter. Same is that if we have this length of 9 cm, the other side, opposite side will also be of 9 cm. First of all, take the baseline that is 8.4 cm. You can also take the baseline 9.6, it is your own choice. I am taking 8.4 cm as a baseline. Then open, your, uh, open the leaves of your compass of the length 9.6 cm. Take B as a center and mark an arc. Same is that taking A as a center and mark the other arc. As we are drawing the rectangle, so in rectangle the sides are straight, straight parallel lines. So draw a line such that your straight line intersect the arc. The point where your straight line intersect the arc given its name as C because A, B, C we are moving, uh, we are following the vectors. Then this length of 8.4 cm so definitely the distance from C to D will be also of 8.4 cm. Take the reading of your compass 8.4 cm. Okay. Open the leaves of a compass of 8.4 cm. Take C as a center and mark the arc such that it intersect the other arc. The point where these two arc these and these intersect each other given its name as D. Now combine the points A with D. Same, find C with D. Now we measure the diagonals. The opposite vertices A and C, when we combining these two vertices, they make one diagonal. Same, the op opposite vertices D and B. When we join these two vertices, they make the other diagonal. Now measure the length of these two diagonals. It is 12.8 centimeter. Now measure the diagonal D and B. which is also 12.8 cm. So it is a complete rectangle with measurements of two diagonals. You can also label the uh, measurements on each side. 9.6 cm as well as this is 8.4 cm. So this is also 8.4 cm. Okay. 